good boy there. And a big smile Making on a this difference. Wednesday. Yeah, right. for that dog. That's great to see. Yeah. All yeah. right. Josh Nichols joins us now. How was the weather today, Josh? Not too. It was nice out beautiful. there. Beautiful. It was beautiful. Great day to walk the pup, and uh, mm -hmm. you know, as Sinatra used to sing, "Life can be so sweet on yeah. the sunny side of the street." Yeah, yes. And uh, we have been on the sunny side of the street here for uh, for a little while now. There might be some changes that we have to address, though, as we head towards uh, the end of the week in particular. But right now, Skywatch 7 showing you all that sunshine out there. There are some clouds uh, off in the distance right now uh, as uh, we do have a little disturbance up towards the Niagara Peninsula. Uh, the highest hourly temperature today in Buffalo at 81 degrees, but officially we made it up to 82, 84 in the falls and uh, 75 in Olean. So bottom line here for this evening, I think you're pretty much good to go. You might see a few clouds off to the north and west out towards the Niagara Peninsula. Otherwise, we'll have some patchy fog into the southern tier and a mainly clear sky. Now tomorrow, almost a carbon copy of today, but there could be an isolated shower developing later into the afternoon or evening. Better chance though lies for uh, Friday with uh, some thundery downpours that'll come in with a cold front. You know that rainfall deficit has been seriously dented in the last few days, but we still have only had 72% of our normal precipitation here for the summer, 60% of normal in Rochester. So our gardens, our farms, our lawns, which are so crispy in many cases, could really use some more moisture. Best chance for seeing some rainfall probably on Friday in some of those uh, thunderstorms that develop. And again, just an isolated chance come tomorrow. Maybe you're already making your weekend plans. You know what I like to say? The W in Wednesday stands really for weekend. And we're going to see a mixture of sun and clouds up for that South Buffalo Irish Festival taking place on Saturday. Temperatures into the mid 70s. As far as the uh, icky sticky meter goes, humidity levels will be rising a little bit over the course of the next couple of days, but they will go into free fall mode, It'd be much more comfortable heading into the weekend. Mostly sunny right now here, as I said, out uh, looking out over uh, the Buffalo waterfront. 80 degrees, the temperature right now, low humidity, great visibility, nice little soft breeze coming in out of the southwest. And the reason for our beautiful weather, high pressure, large and in charge. And with that bubble, there is no trouble to speak of. You can see the cold front here back to the north and west. That is the front that will deliver some of those scattered showers and thundery downpours. And again, wouldn't be shocked to see a little sprinkle out here towards uh, the Niagara Peninsula. Otherwise, the visible view from space here shows the oasis effect from Lake Erie, keeping us nice and clear here downtown. So we have patchy clouds and a bit of fog for tonight. The low temperature 64, 84 should do it for tomorrow with sun and clouds. And again, an isolated shower into the afternoon. There is your super seven day forecast. Again, best chance for seeing some thundery downpours probably on Friday. And then we work our way into the weekend, not just the South Buffalo Irish Fest, but the Elmwood Arts Festival taking place. They're making some plans. Sunday is probably the warmer of the two weekend days. And we get in another round of showers and thunderstorms early next week. Festival season yeah. still rolling along strong. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I spent a lot of time working outside today, making calls, and it was beautiful. It was always nice. nice to take the office outdoors in a day like it this. Is. Won't be doing that in a few months, so. Yeah, yeah. No, not so much. Thank <laughs> you so much. Well, no Josh. storms to worry about right now, but when storms do come in tonight at 530, we're talking about the places you need to avoid when the thunder rolls in. And up next, making music history, the big piece of Buffalo culture that's about to get even bigger. All right, welcome back. A place that celebrates the best of Buffalo music about to get even bigger. Yeah, ground was burned.